So what I'm going to show you now is how to pick up a dropped stitch. It may be that as you've been knitting a stitch has accidentally fallen off your needle or come off somehow maybe as you're knitting the stitch. So what we'll do is I'll just knit to the center of this little piece We'll just drop the next stitch off the needle and unravel it one row. So what you'll, what you'll probably find if it's unraveled, just that one row, is a strand that sits across your knitting. It might be across the front or the back and you'll have the, the loop of the drop stitch sitting there by itself. First thing I would do is insert your needle into the stitch that has been dropped and just pull it up a bit so it doesn't drop down any further. Now depending on which way the stitch needs to be picked up, in this case the strand is at the front which is where we want it to be, what we need to do is take our needle from the back through the stitch that we've dropped to hold it, take your your thumb and anchor it at the bottom of the stitch so that the strand that's dropped is just sitting on top there and then with your right hand needle just grab that loop and pull it up through the the stitch that is unraveled down. You might split your yarn a bit but that's fine just just pick it up like I have and then transfer it onto your left hand needle ready for knitting. Just make sure that you place it on the needle in the correct manner so the right hand side of the stitch will be coming from the front, the left hand side of the stitch will be sitting at the back. So if your stitch, sometimes you might put it on in that manner where the left hand side is sitting at the front and the right hand side sitting at the back, just lift it off and turn it around the right way ready for knitting. Again, making sure it's not twisted in any way. So once you've picked up that stitch that's been dropped, you can continue knitting until the end of the row. And that's how you pick up a drop stitch.